Thank you guys so much for watching another episode. Today's episode is going to be really, really fun. We are going to be giving away 125 spotter bottles after we make them in our kitchen with my mom and dad. And we're going to a birthday party at Chuck E. Cheese. Stay tuned. This one's going to be packed full of fun. Thank you so much for tuning in again. Check out what my brother Kevin made. Yes, now I'm one of the cool kids. Awesome logo. I'm your host, Dan Udy, A1 Carpet Care, changing lives one carpet at a time. So we got invited to a birthday party down in Jacksonville, Florida, which is about an hour away. So we loaded the kids up. Angela drove all the way there and back. And the kids did pretty well. Had a couple little arguments, but we made it through. So I can't remember the last time I went into a Chuck E. Cheese's, but I do remember growing up in Fort Collins, Colorado, we had one. And I remember going there as a child and I had fond memories of that. Turns out the cheese is still not vegan. That was a long ride. All right. There's a shot of the Frevert family, Tony, Amy, Kayla, Elena, and Brennan. And Elena made my day, told me she had subscribed to our channel. So I was like, yay, that's so awesome. She said she really enjoyed my video. So I don't know what that means, but I really enjoyed having her subscribe. This is our table for Natalie, who turned seven today. And we all sat around, had a great time, good food. The staff was amazing, really good customer service, very clean. Uh, surprisingly, I was very impressed with their salad bar. There's a shot of that. I had quite a bit of salad. friends of Natalie's family, the Bargmans, for many years. It really wouldn't have been complete without a picture of me and old Chucky. So this is not an original idea, but we got the idea of making spotter bottles and giving them away to our clients after we cleaned for them um, probably about a year and a half ago. Uh, basically just watching videos on Facebook and copying some of the really good ideas that I'd seen there. So here, obviously you can see it's a good shot of my mom, my dad, Angela and myself, and we are all working diligently. And it actually wasn't quite 130, it came up to 128, but we are all making these spotter bottles. So mom is over at the sink there and she's just filling up these little bottles. They're only eight ounces big, but um, then you see me taking them from the sink. And what I'm doing there is I you have a syringe. It's a 12 cc syringe and I'm just putting an encapsulant polymer based uh, end cap into that water at a very specific dilution ratio. Angela is then taking those bottles, putting a lid on them, drying them off, and then basically an assembly line they go to dad and dad pulls these labels off really amazing full color labels you'll get a good shot at here at the end um, those labels we ordered through a company called prolific prints with a gentleman named uh, ryan kettering who's the owner and i've had a chance to meet him a couple times now at mikey's fest around the country and as a matter of fact angela and i are planning on attending an additional one of these um mikey's fest at the end of next month in nashville tennessee we're really excited about that it's a great place to connect and fellowship with other cleaners from all around the country and in a lot of cases the world. So it's an opportunity to give back to the Ronald McDonald House in all these different locations where we provide a whole bunch of cleaning services and actually raise up quite a bit of money as well and donate that. So a couple reasons we really love the spotter bottles. I guess number one, they're very related to what it is we're doing. There's nothing quite like getting done cleaning your cleaning carpets for somebody and then being able to give them a gift that they didn't expect 
that is going to help them keep their carpets cleaner for longer. And this particular spotter bottle also works really, really well on upholstery. So car interiors, area rugs, it's safe for both synthetic and natural fibers. It's got the directions for use right on the label and talks about how this is a green product and it's really safe for homes and families. Again, I'd really love to sit here and tell you that I came up with this idea, but I copied it and I heard it's okay to be a copycat. Just make sure you copy the right cat. Another reason we really like to give away a spotter bottle at the end of the job is marketing. It keeps our information, our logo, our company name, our colors, our phone number, our website. It keeps it right in front of the customer. Every time they open up their cleaning supply cabinet to get whatever, they're gonna see our spotter bottle, our marketing information right in front of their face. In addition to giving a spotter bottle, we also give away a refrigerator magnet. And whoever the technicians are that are doing the job, we have purchased business cards with their name on it and we encourage them to give them the business cards when they ask for the referral. So one of the reasons we've been so successful in generating so many reviews on Google over the last several months is the fact that when we get done doing a job, we ask our clients to go online and review us on Google. And in order to make it really easy for them, as soon as we leave the job, we actually text them a link that takes them straight to our Google page so they can leave that review immediately. So don't quote me on this, but I'm pretty sure we have over 230 five-star reviews on Google now. So making all these bottles actually took less than 30 minutes, 128 bottles. That should last through the months of, of January, a busy month we usually do in excess of 200 jobs, but January is usually a little bit slower for us. So th again, this batch should put us through either right through January or right up to the very end. Being that we all share a house, this is a fun activity that we can come together and do every few weeks as a family. I anticipate it won't be too much longer before we'll have Marilyn and Warren, our daughter and son helping out as well. We truly have had an amazing response for these spotter bottles. We've had a lot of clients reach out and let us know that that particular bottle of spotter has worked better than anything they purchased in a store and they ask if they can buy more. We always refill for free or just give them an, another bottle. And in a lot of cases, if they call back and, and rave about how well it worked, I'll give them a couple because chances are they probably told their neighbor. But this is a little something that I would encourage any business, if you can, Go ahead and make the investment and have an item that's related to your industry that you can give away at the end of your interaction with any client. Over the years, we've invested into a multitude of different marketing material and promotional products that we give away at the end of the job. This just, to me, happens to be the most relevant to our particular service and industry. So because we buy all these items in bulk, the labels from Ryan Kettering, the bottles, the solution, we're able to make these, produce these in our kitchen here for very, very affordable. I think they only cost right around $1.30 per bottle. So for over a decade, I did absolutely no marketing to our existing client base. Matter of fact, we did very, very little to no advertising whatsoever. With, of course, the exception of a website and word of mouth. Well, and I also have to admit, we did the yellow pages for far too many years than we should have. But I can happily report no more. And once I learned a little bit about marketing and, the, and how much more affordable it is to market to your existing client base versus trying to get new clients, uh, this was only one of many things that we implemented and have had a lot of success with. For anybody watching, I'd be very interested to hear what's worked well for you in your specific business or what particular items have you received from other businesses that you've had interactions with that have been your favorite. So feel free to leave a comment in the section below, like this video. If you wanna see more videos like this one, let us know that as well. I've had a blast trying to think up content for these daily vlogs and being that we didn't have any jobs for today, I figured, one cool thing would be to speed this up and show you guys exactly how many spotter bottles that we can pump out in a relatively short period of time. So mom and dad, we're happy to come on board. They've helped us make these things, I don't know how many times now, but more than a few, and we always seem to have a really good time. And we're all done, 128 spotter bottles. Wait till you see these. These are so cool. You can see the blue and the green and our logo, uh, the name of our company, obviously, our phone number. It's just a really nice, sharp looking piece.
What do you think about these spotter bottles, buddy? Good. I really hope everybody's enjoying watching these as much as I'm enjoying making them. So please let me know what type of videos you'd like to see more of, less of. Please like, share, and subscribe if you haven't already. And stay tuned for more. I'm doing this vlog now at least for the next 30 days.